So the latest product that we launch is keeping in mind everything that goes into the engineering of a solar project where the module is used and that is the 730 watt peak universe series. That module is going to be the commercially available module and when you look at a project savings then you are saving 2% on the other components and on top of that when you look at the land savings then the land reduction is by a massive amount. Almost, uh, 10% you would be reducing land because comparing it with the regular 550 watt peak modules or even the currently available 600 watt peak range. And this will be uh, available for all of our customers starting from January. So we've been uh, doing EPC uh, projects from quite some time and uh, most of our module was being used by all the uh, AAA rated companies, EPC or government PSUs and all. So we had a 1.1 gigawatt till last year. We added 2.2 uh, gigawatt. So now we are at 3.3 gigawatt module manufacturing. Other than that, uh, we started making a uh, string combiner box. We started making uh, electrical side because we understand the difficulties of EPC and losses and other parameters of uh, when we are doing projects. So that's how we develop a uh, number of products. We are uh, evolving and uh, coming up with uh, very unique uh, uh, structures and uh, uh, trackers also, which is in pipeline. And uh, we have a number of very reputed projects like company like Coal India, NLC, uh, Navy Limited, uh, all Gujarat Discoms, uh, GUNL. Very recently, uh, we awarded a very large uh, project from AP government, uh, more than 1700 crore. So we are fairly good. We are on much better way, uh, what we expected. We are on the right track and uh, we are coming up with the BESS, uh, where the post uh, battery cell uh, battery pack and all the way up to container fully automated lines. Uh, we're setting up five gigawatt in Gujarat and 5 gigawatt we are exploring in uh, southern state, uh, south uh, south of India. So probably by one year from now we'll have uh, 10 gigawatt of uh, BESS uh, container solution ready. 100% uh, domestic uh, uh, BES, BMS, battery management software. Uh, it is already ready, it's been running uh, in uh, US and other market for the last seven, eight years, nine years actually. And uh, that is also part of uh, COSOL now. So we are launching a complete software solution along with the container uh, pack. And uh, uh, what uh, Kyan mentioned about the residential rooftop. So we are fully integrated uh, solar solution providing company. And that is our uh, objective for last uh, eight, ten years. We started module manufacturing way early in 2012 when the industry was at very niche level, very uh, uh, stepping stone. But now uh, industry is also evolving and we are not rushed as increasing our megawatt to gigawatt capacity in terms of manufacturing. But whatever we are doing, uh, you know, we want to be a best in class. We have uh, practically zero claim uh, from our customers. Uh, so I think we are very, uh, we have focus is prime is quality, not the numbers. And uh, we are very happy that we are on right track. I think uh, uh, probably by September, uh, the product will be ready. We are ready with the software. We are ready with the other things. Uh, all the procurement is underway. And we are very confident that uh, we should be launching by June or let us by uh, September next year. And to add to that, whenever we launch a product, we always do extensive testing behind it. So before any launching of PV module that we do to the public, we have almost seven months of testing that goes behind it. Our traditional testing is around three to four months. We go beyond that. Even when you look at the three times IEC, we are going pushing past that as well. So on the BASS side, we'll be doing that as well. We'll be taking a lot of our products to failure, seeing what is going on, how is it reacting? Because uh, like he said, we've been serving this segment for a large part in the US for uh, the last nine years. That is part of Coastal now. 
and uh, the Indian market, the Indian climate and atmosphere and the usage patterns are completely different. So seeing all of that, we also want to do extensive testing on our side before we release any product out to the market. Because like I said, for us, quality is the most important factor. We don't want, we don't want to rush a product into a market without knowing what all has gone behind it. I think uh, ecosystem is uh, very well geared up and uh, a lot of good uh, Indian manufacturers are coming up and uh, we are happy with our uh, plants. We are not getting into solar cell uh, because there are a lot of, uh, uh, lot of R&D and research required if you really want to make a good cell. And uh, we, we are expert on module. We are expert on EPC, we are expert on all how to save, uh, minimize the losses on uh, do while doing EPC or we develop many uh, different products which runs with the solar. So total we have almost 30 products which we can run with the solar. Even small, uh, small, small product like you know, uh, you might have seen outside there's a benches with the lights and batteries and all uh, for domestic usage. So we try to make uh, like the, what he mentioned about Corum uh, Energy, uh, which is uh, mainly focused on agriculture. So we have, if we have number of products which eventually is going to help a lot to our Indian farmer, will they save a lot of money instead of burning diesel? Uh, they will have a natural energy, and uh, we're trying to build uh, what Modi ji thinks. We just wanted to be uh, at par or maybe few step ahead of. Uh, the industry in terms of uh, product which actually empowering uh, solar living. Yeah, I think uh, nobody in the industry is like what we are. We have 360 degree solution which means we practically make all the product which runs with the solar. Not the small, small, very small product like uh, garden lights and all. We are not into that segment, but uh, but otherwise we have uh, all the products you know which can really help to the industry. Uh, not right now, but looking to our expansion and uh, we are looking for uh, very large uh, RE supply to green hydrogen, green ammonia, and uh, so that segment is also uh, quite encouraging. And uh, we're not sure yet, but uh, if something is there, we'll definitely update you. Yeah.